Meantime, Israeli tanks have seized control of Gaza's vital Rafah border crossing. The move comes despite urgent warnings from close allies, including the United States, against moving into the southern city where millions of civilians have taken refuge. Palestinian defense officials say 15 people, including a child, have been killed. Overnight, Israeli officials rejected a ceasefire proposal that Hamas had put forth late yesterday. Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu says the deal does not meet its core demand, but negotiations are expected to continue today.